Okay, so the next thing you're going to do is just put a rhythm on top of your subdivided beats, anything that you want. Um, you can put it in any time. Uh, you can make it um, your voice or you can clap it or you can actually make um, a beat pattern using our um, stuff on Soundtrap. But first, pick a rhythm that you like. You can, um, I have face, mass, rest, rest. Toilet paper, rest, distant learning, rest, rest, six feet apart, rest, stay at home, rest, we miss playing together. So you could do one of those and go a few times. You can do two of those, whatever you think would sound cool. So you could do distant learning, rest, rest, stay at home, rest. Distant learning, rest, rest, stay at home. Um, you could clap it. The biggest thing is that you need to know your rhythm and be able to do it with your soundtrack beat so far. So I muted my, um, my voice counting the rhythm because that's just... Um, not really helping me right now. So I'm just gonna listen to this and just be able to say my two rhythms. Distant learning, stay at home. Distant learning, stay at home. And I don't have to do it a few, I could do it once, I could do it a few times, whatever I feel comfortable with. So what I'm going to do is actually get a um, earbuds and stick it in the output just so I don't have reverb of myself um, and hearing all the other beats. So right now I have a earpiece in my ear um, and then it's plugged in. Say okay. And I'm just going to say my, my rhythms. I'm going to add a new track by adding voice microphone, and I'm just going to say it as I'm listening to it and feel the beat. Okay. So here I go. Okay, I'm going to stop recording to delete that because I had too many things up here and I can't see what I'm doing. Um, okay, here I go. So in a minute, it's going to come up and I'm listening to it to distant learning, stay at home. Distant learning, stay at home. And that's it. I didn't do it all the time. Less is more sometimes. And let's see what I did. That was from before. I'm just going to delete that. I'm clicking too many things. If I can figure out how to delete it. Well, I'll figure that out later. Okay. It doesn't matter. Let's listen to what you can hear. Okay, and I, because I was like talking during that part, I'm just gonna cut that self out, okay? It doesn't move anything, and I'm going to edit, um, I just wanna delete that. I'll figure it out how to delete that. Cut, oh, there's, there you go. Um, so yeah, and I can listen to it. Now, that's just one that's doing the rhythm. I can also, do the distant learning, stay at home with our patterns. So distant learning is just a 
subdivided beat. So I would just do that every other beat, distant learning, but there was a rest rest. I could have done distant learning. I could have two sounds here too. I want to, and then stay at home. Realize that it's not stay at home like that because this is all one beat, stay at home. And I can keep on going if I want to, but remember um, there's other stuff going on. So I might just wait until the end and I might do distant learning again with that extra little hi-hat and then stay at home. And remember, I don't have anything here because it's a rest and I think it goes to measure nine, stay at home. So let's see if I can move over a little bit. Stay at home. Here I go, let's listen to that. At home. And then rest and learning. My other parts are going. Stay at home. Distant learning. Stay at home. Okay. So there's some things to fix. But um, overall, I'm probably just going to get rid of that one. Um, I kind of like it. So have fun with it. You can pick if you want to do both for the rhythms, um, if you just want to do one of them. So you can speak it or clap it with a microphone. You can actually add the beats with the patterns. I hope this was helpful. Bye.